Hello, lovelies, and welcome to Aren't You Exhausted, a podcast about Amber Lynn Reed, a 500-pound YouTuber on a weight loss journey to trolling her audience. Let's discuss the funny, silly, quirky little things that our girl gets into, and along the way, we can also discuss some of the people she's associated with online or in her personal life to add some flair to her story. I'm your host, Ashley, and let's start today's discussion. Hello, lovelies. It's your girl, Ashley. And this is Aren't You Exhausted? Um, <laughs> so this is going to be a mini episode. We've hit 60 subscribers, so I thought I would do another bonus. Maybe I'll do it every 10 subscribers. <laughs> we'll do like a mini episode. But I really wanted to get this information out there because I just watched the video and I'm just, I'm gobsmacked. So let me preface this by saying this vlog was probably meant to be on a more serious note, but I can't take it seriously. Amberlynn starts it out like a normal Amberlynn Reed content vlog. And then we go into waterworks. So here we go. Amberlynn is back at it again with grocery hauling. Uh, snooze fest we get to see a veggie dicer which correct me if i'm wrong didn't she get a veggie dicer months ago in her and wifey's amazon hauls uh where she was an affiliate i could have sworn she got a veggie slicer and gushed over wanting having wanted it because she hated chopping veggies but that, i mean i could be wrong uh she went through her pet's toys and got rid of some of them and started decorating for halloween and then we got to the juicy bits. We open up to Crocodile Tears and Ankle Gate <laughs> was brought back up. Um, her personal life issues were brought back up, but never really discussed. Um, other health issues that she's having, also not really discussed. She cleaned herself up in the viewfinder and sucked back in some tears and then cleared things up that she didn't have a heart attack, even though she was having similar symptoms and discussed ankle, <laughs> her ankle having healed incorrectly um, because of how she had to accommodate herself getting in and out of her bed due to her morbid obesity. Um, she clarified things from the ER visit and then went into her follow-up visit with her doctor. Um, she said that she felt something was wrong, that she was misdiagnosed in the emergency room, and after her doctor looked over her charts from the emergency room... Through x-ray, it was found that her lung may be partially collapsed and she may have a blood clot as it wasn't tested in the emergency room. Um, my whole thought process is she wonders why all these things could be happening to her. And I'm like, oh, she probably thinks it's not all due to her weight. Right, Amberlynn? <laughs> Life is just bullying you. <laughs> like, come on. What are you guys' thoughts? Do you think she's going to be this is going to be a wake up call to kick her in the ass and get into gear with weight loss and taking her health a little bit more seriously. Or do you think it's going to be the same old, same all? Um, I think she can only be so cavalier with her health for so long before it's going to eventually catch up to her. I mean, look at Jennifer Gwen Ann. And since uterine cancer didn't adjust her habits, I don't foresee this changing anything. Also, the obvious not clickbait in the title of the video. Can we even be sure this isn't some trumped up story for views at this point? The tears just seemed really ingenuine and rehearsed. And how she was able to clean herself up temporarily just screams something is off with the story to me. But I guess we'll see where this goes. <laughs> That's the end of this mini discussion. What are your guys' thoughts? Leave it in the comments below. Thanks for listening and see you guys next episode. Bye. Aren't You Exhausted is now on Spotify. You can find the link down in the drop box below. If you want to help support this podcast, please subscribe, like, or leave a comment.